All right, another week. It is Monday. I don't know why I'm seeming so excited to you. I had to check. Microphone is on because, I mean, I'm doing this on Saturday, so I still have some uh, time off. I don't know why I'm putting my hands in the WASDA because this is all mouse. Anyway, all right. So, you know, this is Diverse World, which makes me feel like KLLM, that this isn't Russia. And this may be a, another Russian-speaking country, potentially Ukraine. Although these are P's, there's H11. I mean, that's my only sense of deduction here is that this is not Russia because there's enough Russian ones they would do something else. However, I'm not seeing an H13 anywhere, which concerns me. Anyway, how was your weekend? Was it fantastic? I just got done golfing earlier today, and I am feeling a bit of a sunburn. Like, not bad, bad, but it's noticeable. Um, it's playing well. I mean, it's golf. Nobody cares. I did fine. I enjoyed my time. Um, potentially found a place to get a membership for next year. <laughs> rich. I'm not rich. Um... I, I'm like 90% sure this is Ukraine. And it's the only reason I'm hovering around here, but I have not found enough to completely declare this the actual place. But I had a thought today in the, in, in the car on my way to uh, work today. I drove by a garage sale. This is, I'm just going to tell you my thought. What the fuck? This dude is... Oh, he jumped on the camera and attacking it with a sock? I don't know. I'm crazy people. Um, here's my thought process for how I got to thinking about this. And you can do whatever you want with, <clears throat> excuse me, with it. Is that like bag wine instead of box wine? It's bag wine. Um, so there was a garage sale happening at a on the street as I was going my way to the golf course today. And uh, I saw this kid just standing on uh, just some random thing that you can usually see on the side of the road. That's like, that's something important, like electrical, but you really have no idea exactly what it is. But um, it just popped in my head. This, it, it just, my brain was like, is this kid working? Why, why aren't kids working? Then it went from that to, Say, we always talk about in the future that um, eventually we'll get to the point where the uh, computer brain in interface is just like a thing that happens. You don't think anything about it. And uh, if you want to learn anything, it's just like in the Matrix. You download it. You thought of it. Boom. That's it's it's in your head. Well, what if I did click on Ukraine? Um, that becomes so commonplace that school is limited to however fast information is put into your head. And, um, all right, so school, which is first grade through high school, if you want to go to college, it's that too. And if you want master's, it's that too. It's what, four, eight, another four years for uh, grad school. So that's 12 right there, plus the, it's like 24 years, uh, whatever. It's a long time. And what if all of that, was just condensed into, I don't know, a couple hours for you to transfer into your brain. That is so much time. That's Husqvarna sign, I believe. That was, uh, yeah, Husqvarna. This, this very well could be Ukraine, and then it could very well turn into like, oh, this is um, Lithuania. You were completely off, because... Um, let's see, is there... Oh, it was Ukraine, just on the border between that and Slovakia. So I was still, oh, eight thirteens over there. What do you do with all of that time not um, going to school? Do they start work? Do, when you're, do you start work like, all right, so uh, you start your download, we'll call it, at the age of seven. All right, seven's done. Now it's, uh, this is another questionable central, like, former... Soviet Socialist Republic, perhaps like in here. This is just what I'm narrowing it down to. It doesn't mean that it's true. Do you start working at seven? What are like seven-year-old jobs? 
like child labor is that gonna be a thing now or we're like all right so you do learn things we need to get to the point where uh what do you point at all right so you've learned it now your body has to like develop into the skills so you're like all right we're gonna go to body training for however many years that takes for you to build like i think it's myelination where like you've done a repetitive task enough times to the point where um it happens just easily like uh you think about the first time you ever took a step as a kid now it's just subconscious because you've done it enough times that the neural pathways have uh i think it's myelination i could be getting this wrong um it's it's like some sort of coating you put over the nerves to make the process happen faster so you don't have to think about it like patting your head and rubbing your stomach where it was hard to do probably the first couple times you did it but then with enough practice it's just like oh i can do that just fine it, it's like that with um potentially all right so all the kids you've learned your thing now what we can't we can potentially have all right, so that's Jer. Are we like in this pocket again? Like, I I'm not entirely sold where we are just yet. I mean, these are Mack trucks; they can go a lot of places. Like, apparently, this is Denmark. <laughs> like, how are we going to handle future things when everything becomes just? Wait, is this is this Turkey? LT. Like, this feels like this should be Turkish, but that says that could be IT or LT. I mean, maybe it's Italy. Like, what the? This is, like, desolation land. Like, desolation not because of, like, man-made shit just doesn't happen here anymore, but it's just, like, we haven't developed this part of the world yet. Like, th there's potential stuff here. It just hasn't gone anywhere yet. But anyway, like, are we going to be okay in like 200 years with, I don't know, eight year olds working at McDonald's or when you're eight, now you're a surgeon. I mean, you could argue the fact that they're young. There's a certain age, like, especially with like Twitch things, fast Twitch things that the younger you are, the better you are at those things. Like if you ever talk to people who uh, play Dota or watch Dota or any like fighting games, there is a significant difference the older you get. Your reaction times definitely go. That's dot and O. So we've got a pocket here that makes me feel like maybe here in Poland. But I'm not sold anywhere yet because I haven't seen any signs. This does not feel like Poland at all. Like I, this, is, this is just like nondescript Eastern Europe. To me, at least, because I don't, I don't know things, and I'm willing to admit it. Well, I don't know what else I get really to say about that other than just like, fuck. It was I was right the first time in in Kyrgyzstan. Well, that's on me. Threw me for a loop. Well, it was bound to happen eventually. Like, there's just a thought, and it's gonna be. I may know exactly where this is. However, this root sign does not indicate anything to me yet. Because I don't think there's a root like that in this state. And those are not, like, completely um, limited to one locate. Like, there's multiple Burlington's, there's multiple Linden's. And this does not feel like the one state I think it is, and it may just be the other state that's next to this state. I just need to see another goddamn road sign, and I'm not. Like, the more this happens, the more I'm pretty sure it's not the state I think it is. This may be Massachusetts, though. I need to see another road sign, and I feel I've chosen the wrong direction to go. But. Future man, it's gonna happen, and these are gonna be issues that are going to happen. See Nebraska, so this this is gonna probably be Midwest Route seventy five. Um, I think then I need to find seventy five. I found it. Now I just need to find a uh, Burlington and a Linden. There's a Linden. 
So is this 35? Or is this 335? I just happened to find that street. I mean, this, the route. I'm not going to completely take credit for what I, for knowing these things, but we'll see. I mean, I'm sure there's other people smarter than me who have actually thought of these things and are actually addressing them right now. Okay, this is Linden and Burlington. We're headed, maybe it's like here? Maybe it's 56. I don't, I gotta find like the entrance onto this road off this exit. So this is how I'm gonna do it. Malvern Lake, John Redmond Reservoir. All right, get me to this exit. This is how we do it. It's Friday night and I feel all right. Party's down on the west side. I think it's how it goes. All right, yeah, 35 south to Wichita. So is this technically south? But we're going to Linden and Burlington. Let me, let me, oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, back up. This is, this, no, back up, I said. So that is Route 50 West. Where is Route 50? That's 50, right? It's south 35. It's also Route 50. Okay, that's 50. Okay. Um, God, I feel like it's, it's, it's in this area, but why would these two places be on the same exit? Oh, because you can go left or right and get to either one. All right. I'm going to say we were heading south, so it's coming back north. We're like right here, maybe like right here. And I got a lot of points to make up after fucking up that Kyrgyzstan one, but I've never been to Kyrgyzstan, so give me a break. Kansas City is the other way heading north we were heading north though weren't we yeah 35 north to kansas city so heading south what did this say we were going to when we hit south man i forget shit so quickly south to wichita and wichita is hmm i think we might be far no i pretty much nailed it all right Never mind. I'm going to say this is Taiwan. I am I almost feel like click on it now and no, but I'm not going to do that. Because, okay, we got potential. This could be Vietnam. I'd like to understand why my brain thinks it's these things. No, this is, this is totally South Korea. The only reason I think that is because, like, their character. This is the way I can tell the difference between Chinese and Japanese and Korean. Is Koreans like word letters and symbols? I feel like more cartoonish, like bubbly, like more nuanced. I, there's not as much like like flair. I don't know how else to put it. But if you look at like Korean and then you look at like Japanese or Chinese, there's there is a pretty noticeable difference between the two. And I, if I end up getting this wrong, I'll be like, well, I mean, I'm not flexible enough to put my foot in my mouth. But, like, look. See how they're writing, and then this is just kind of more... Basic's the wrong word. I just need, I need better vocabulary. I'm an idiot. I need to get on a road that'll tell me some roots. I'd like to go to this country. I feel that, uh... Where the fuck am I? Uh, let's hit home. And then turn around and go this way. Can I go this way? Or am I, like, stranded? No, I'm going to follow this path. And a fun little fact I found out about rice is it doesn't need water to grow. Like, you know, rice patties, the way they are, they don't actually need the water to grow. They just do that because it's easier to get rid of weeds, which is pretty smart. Like, it's the same thing. You could, like, I don't know if corn could be the same way. Grow corn and water. But, like, no, it's easier to get rid of the... uh insects and whatnot or weeds if you've just got it growing in water and then like it there's uh i think it was a national geographic or maybe nature i don't know it was some sort of nature show at least that they talked about rice patties being around for so long that the um flora and fauna whatever you want to call it have uh adapted to living in like rice patties seasonal shit like that 
And you wonder how long does it actually Korea Expressway Corporation? You wonder how long what are you? Oh, you're a gate? Isn't that cute? Even your gates are cute. I wonder how long it actually takes for uh Okay, we got a road sign. I'm not gonna be able to understand any of this though, because I don't see any routes anywhere. Like what is the threshold for like nature, biology, things like that, actually being able to uh is there any road signs and you don't put road signs on? Oh my god. Oh my god. How do you expect me to find anything in this country? How long does it take for like adaptations like that to happen? Well, you know, okay, after a hundred years you start doing a thing. Is it five hundred years? How how does this work? This country is small enough that it's not really gonna matter too much, but god damn labor your roads more noticeably. Okay, I got the 20, a 37. There's potential. No, it's not, not potential anymore. This is the first time I've actually tried to deal with roots in this country, so, uh, anything that happens here, I feel, I don't know why I keep following this one road, like, it's gonna tell me anything, because, that fuck, this 37, it goes everywhere. 55. Oh, it was on the other side of the country. Whatever. Last one. I've seen this before. I can't tell you where yet. Oh, also, I think I'm a pretty big idiot. I can't even say the word idiot. Like, the last episode that came out where I didn't even... Skadarsko? I, I didn't even think to call it Cologne. I just call it Koln, even though it clearly says Cologne. And then why can't you countries just, like, uh, agree on one writing for it? Because the way that I see it, Cologne, it's probably, like, the French way of spelling it. I really don't know. I think, I think, what is happening to me? We're, like, in this part of the world. Like, around here, I just don't know where yet. I mean, I've been completely wrong before, so... Nerds to that, I guess. Sobra. Okay, none of this stuff helps me yet. That I don't know why if I like actually sat and thought about it instead of just instantly being having my brain go, oh no, this is the exact way it's supposed to be spelled or said. But if I actually took a break and you know thought about it a bit, this wouldn't be a problem. But not to my brain. Hmm. Like that name that that place is. I've heard, I, I swear I've heard it before. So I don't want to click anywhere yet, but we're in a Balkan or Baltic? No, it's, it's, it's Adriatic. Like a Baltic and Balkan is what I always seem to get it confused with. I think it's Balkan. Please, uh, Correct me in the comments below, because I will need it. Sakdar, Skadar Lake. None of this helps me. It's the new Mediterranean. Like, there's no U. It's duckly.com. So you've got access to the Mediterranean. I almost want to, like, split the difference and put you in Macedonia, but I know that's not right. These billboards. Like, I want to say this This has to be, like, farther, farther north. Because we're kind of in a touristy region of what a south, oh, southern, you're so close to telling me where we are. Like, it, there's something there. But I can't see it, make it out. This is beautiful, though. I would definitely visit this place. Like, this feels like Croatia, like maybe north, like maybe Montenegro. Like, that almost looks like. Yeah, like that almost looks like back there on that poster. And like, we're crossing a bridge here. I'm like so taking a huge stab at this, but I feel like I got it. 
like if I go back, as a matter of fact, let me, uh, wow, look at that. Look at this. Like, I'm probably wrong now, because this kind of doesn't look like it now, but, fuck, man, this is, this is a, like, Vrangina sounds like a thing I've seen before, and I, now I'm kind of like, how, am I going to be, like, getting this so wrong? I don't feel like it. Vrangina. My Christ. Nailed it. Fucking nailed it. This wasn't so bad. It would have probably t turned out better, but hey, that's how these rounds work. I feel like I've never seen a Kyrgyz stand one before, so excuse me. Those fucking trucks threw me for a loop. I thought I did pretty well, for all things considered, but Monday's down, folks. Um, hope you had a good weekend. Hope you're planning on having a good week, because like it or not, it's going to happen. And if it's going to suck, well, just know that the days go by faster than you think. Anyway, that's going to do it for here. Thank you all for watching. You know the deal. Like, favorite, comment, subscribe. Tell your friends. Tell me. Tell me any comments. Um, as of right now, I don't know what's for Tuesday, if there is going to be a Tuesday. Anyway, uh, you guys really haven't told me anything. If you've got suggestions for anything to do for those two days. If not, I'm just going to maybe revert back to it seems whatever it seems to get views and tractions because most of the things I try don't seem to work. But anyway, um, we'll at least see you back on Wednesday for some more GeoGuessr. But until then, have a good one. We'll see you real soon.